Previously on Asia's Next Top Model. Welcome to Bangkok, Thailand, and welcome to Asia's Next Top Model, CycleTech. 14 girls began their top model journey with an introduction to their alumni mentors. This is the first time ever in top model history where the top model alumni have been brought back here to mentor the new contestants. The girls were thrown straight into their first challenge. By the end of this challenge, two of you will be going home. Two girls? It's so brutal. The heat was on as the girls struck their stuff for a place in the competition. And even though Sharni fumbled, I have in my hands a list of our top 12. It was Lena and Hody who didn't make the cut. I was like, wait, where is my name? Where's my name? I have them at best. Maybe another girls have them better. At a Wild Things photo shoot, the girls were immediately made to face their fears. Shooting with some creepy co-stars. Hey. Mamma mia! Oh, careful, you'll go back up. Oh, that's so bad. Model through that fear. Beautiful. While most girls jump straight into the wild. Scream and yell and growl. Sharni froze like a deer in headlights. It was Beauty who came out tops at elimination. Beauty, you really are our diamond in the rough. Just need to polish off the edges a little bit. While Sharni's self-consciousness proved to be her biggest downfall. Ooh. Who's that? It's Beauty! I'm so surprised that I won this week, but it gave me a pressure. You're such a lucky girl, I hate you! <laughs> because the girls are talking about me. It's actually the iguana that won. Yeah. Seeing Beauty picture on the wall was great. Definitely the iguana was shining. Bye, girls. I love you so much, Mama V. <laughs> Princess Adela. I still cannot accept. It was kind of sad to see Charney's goodbye message. And on the other hand, it's like, yay! The side of the bed's empty now. No kiddos room first loss. I think this cycle is so hard. If we lost for God, we out. I feel sorry about Shani. That's what we signed up for, though. It's not going to get any easier. The absence of Shiny makes us remember that this is a competition and we're just going to have to get used to seeing girls go home. It's stressful for me, man. I almost not make it. Yes! I'm so happy. I'm still in my room right now. And this girl's room is still complete. Oh my god, but I love you girls, so I love you, you, man. Oh my god. We were all just really happy that Justin leave. Oh, <laughs> really? You're not um, going anywhere. I'm a model. Yeah. I'm not a stand-up comedian. <laughs> She's the little <laughs> like really straightforward, really just out there. Mia, how do you feel about Sharni leaving? Because I feel like you look really sad. I am. I'm really surprised by how hard it's hitting me. Oh. I think Mia is a little like overly nice to everyone and I don't buy it. But I don't know what it is, but something. I'm just so happy that we're here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Noisy team. I feel like we have a really good vibe going on. We're like the noisy girls. Yeah. So noisy. It's an empty bed there, if you want. I'm so happy my girl survived the first elimination. 
but my team needs quite a bit of work. How are you, Eko? I'm quite confused because I give everything in a photo shoot, but to be honest, I don't get the feeling. Photo shoot, yeah, it's kind of like all I do is just runway. That is why you need to practice in the mirror to see your bad habits and everything, because it just over time it develops your bad habits. I want the girls to forget old habits and bring in the new, but it's always nice to have add freshness again to yourself. So now, it's a new week. Let's all start fresh. This is a clean slate. And even if you're bottom two, as long as they learn from it, they can come out on top. We're still complete. Team Monica still going. Yeah. Yeah. How are you girls? We're okay. With Shiny being eliminated last week, it took a toll a lot on my girls. Tough morning after an elimination. I'm actually really happy that you guys realize that it's competition at the end of the day. Yes, you have to be ready all the time. Moving forward with my girls this week, I am going to train them and make them adapt to situations because you never know what to expect. Right now, you know where you stand. You know beauty is going to be beautiful all the time. He's a threat now. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's good. Keep that in mind, like in a way that you motivate to beat her. My game plan this week is go hard in everyone I be like a horse you do this <laughs> Hi. how do you feel guys I feel proud for our team I'm not because only one best performance but three in the bottom I'm quite disappointed with Han and Pim in the bottom three and four I feel that they're not really focused 100% I'm disappointed in myself I know I could have done better yeah you guys have potential, but you guys don't know how to use this. And um, please, you, 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 come out your personality. Yeah. I feel that all of my girls still so safe. And I want to try to push them to make them come out. I want to see more from them. Congratulations on making it through your first week of the competition. Thank you. Now it's time for a fresh start, and we feel this is the perfect time for a... Ah, oh my god, finally! I mean, it's only week two, but finally I've been dying for this moment. I'm sure you are eager to find out exactly what look you will be getting. Yes. I bet that we're not gonna know what we're getting from makeovers. Well, you will just have to wait. This is a surprise makeover. Oh. You will only find out when it's done. We know you're probably feeling nervous and anxious about your makeovers, but we want you to trust the process. Cindy and all of us only want what's best for you. So, are you girls ready for your makeovers? Yeah! Let's go, girls! Oh my god, this huge salon. Fancy! I'm ready for this makeover already. I just want to introduce you to the person behind all of your new looks today. She's the director of Kevadi Gandini Hairdressing Academy and Master Ambassador of International Hair Brand in Bangkok for 11 years, Miss Saisuda Chihuahuiwat. Sawadika! Sawadika! Hi, ladies! Welcome to Kevadi Gandini Academy. My team and I are very excited to get started with your makeover, and I'm sure that you will look amazing. My inspiration of each of the girl look is from their characteristic. Some girls can have dramatic look, and some of them just refreshing. Wow, you have very straight hair. Very straight hair. Jesslyn, she has strong Asian look. I love that look. I give her a chopstick blunt cut. I'm in the bottom two last week, so please, 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 something nice for Jasmine. You are very new look. Okay. Feminine, more younger. Okay. You would only find out what's happening while it was happening. I think that was really scary. It's not as if we can stop it when they're mid-chop. Huh? I've never done a makeover before like this. At this point, I'm just like, I don't care. Put anything on me, I'll make it work. I am good and confident. The cutting is going up, up, up. Is it too much? I don't get short hair. Don't move, stay still. It takes only five minutes to cut. Okay. The stylist says she's going to give me an expensive look. 
and I saw blue color. Uh, excuse me, blue? Blue? And I was like, what? <laughs> the head stylist says, you're gonna walk out of here looking three years younger. Guess I'll look 20 again. Whatever that means, haircut wise. I have short hair. What can you expect? Shorter? Shaving? You will look sophisticated, this hair. I wanted something more edgy. I do see some hair getting snipped, but it wasn't drastic. I'm kind of disappointed right now. You know, I've never dyed my hair or anything. So when I saw this, it's blue. I'm like, oh, that was so annoying. I was like, what is this? What is that? What, what is happening to me? <gasps> it's, it's torture. <laughs> I'm so happy. I've always wanted to try a perm, just no bangs. Oh, I am very curious what we are going to get. We, I just love her hair, but as a model, the hair is just a bit too long. So scary. Where did I cut it? How long did I cut it? I lost the hair. Oh my god, I lost half my hair now. I wanted to see someone cry. I know, but... <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I mean, they were pretty, like, vague when they told us what's gonna happen, so maybe as things go on... Eat my popcorn. When it got to the point that my hair was somewhat at my eye level, I kind of panicked. These long bangs. How am I supposed to work with this? Oh, my crying, Chimai. Adela. I was like... Oh, my God. beautiful. I have quite a naturally baby face. The fact that I have this hair that makes me look cuter, I was just thinking they're making it harder for me. Why are you crying? You look so beautiful. How dare you cry? I feel like I might have a harder time standing out with this hair because I look so cute. Adela is like, yeah, I look so cute. I was a bit weak, I think. Even you don't like the hair, the hair will curl up again. Yeah. No, that's... Yeah, I know. You will deal with this? Yeah, I'll work with it. I look like a sheep. I'm gonna you look like a what? Sheep. A sheep. <laughs> so everything's done. Perm is completed. And then the hit style is just like... Bleh. No! Shit! They're gonna give me bangs. Tell me anything. I'm just there, clueless. After they cut my hair, I feel really like it. I look still as expensive girl and have a cool hairstyle. <laughs> when I look at another girl, I see two girls have a style like me. It's the same. I like it. You don't like it? Me, Jesslyn, and V has the same haircuts. V, please. After they cut my hair, I still look pretty. But this really look like a normal girl, like another girl. I thought she was joking because I see her really beautiful. I'm so angry. Oh my god, seriously? I want to slap your face. So what do you want? I don't know. I feel so normal. Nothing special anymore. Don't be insecure. Stop. I don't want to look to the same as another girl. I can do something else. Oh my god! I feel like, oh no, that's too simple for her. I will give her another haircut. I'm very surprised when she says I will bring to you a new look. Yes, just cut my hair. When I see the hairstylist cut my hair, I feel I have Shaw here. When I see the hairstylist cut my hair, I feel I have Shaw here. How are you feeling? This is the first time I have Shaw here. I don't know that. I can handle with it or not. You don't even know how it's gonna look yet. They're still doing it. You have to push beyond your limits, right? Are you gonna stop crying now? Mm-hmm. Yeah, stop crying.
I'm so nervous, but at the same time, I trust the hairstylist. I know that I will look good no matter what. I feel confident with all of these girls after the makeover that we did, that will help them to be ready for the rest of the competition. Ooh, I'm so happy. Oh Thank God. you. I feel so happy. Watch out me. New thing is coming and you will scared. This haircut gave me the IG look I want, and I'm really thankful for that. I think the color of my hair is amazing. So now I have highlights. I think I can rock it. New hair, new me, a new pip. I'm disappointed with this kind of short hair, but I will stand out more because this is like extreme change. I think the only way to deal with this hair is to completely embrace it. This could be a blessing in disguise and I might have the opportunity to show more modeling skills and not just be a pretty face. I think that I had the most drastic makeover out of all the 11 girls. I feel like my head is the biggest now. It helps me stand out for sure. I just need to learn how to work with bags. The color, it makes me more high fashion look. I love it. I'm shaking my hair all the time. This is my hairstyle. I will not go wrong with it. Wish me luck, finger crossed, fresh hair, fresh start, fresh look. Give me a fresh performance too. I love my hair. I got everything I asked for. I'm gonna rock the next photo shoot so hard. Look at me, I'm a rock star. Hello ladies, welcome back from your new makeovers. I hope you are all embracing your new looks and are ready to celebrate your transformation. As you prepare for the upcoming photo shoot, remember the story of the ugly duckling. Good luck, girls. Is she saying we're still ugly or we're like... <laughs> What? Are we all ugly? <laughs> So maybe the photo shoot is something to reflect with our new look. Maybe it's not afraid of looking ugly. I think the photo shoot is going to be us looking ugly and trying to make it work. We shall see. Hi, girls. Hi. Hi. I definitely spend a lot of time hanging out with the girls in the quiet room because we just get along really well. What's up? Rubini and Jazz and Pim are so strong. And I feel like I haven't really had the chance to speak as much, I feel like. It's not really a conversation. It's more a performance and I get to watch. So I can I can just come here. I felt like I was the most quiet of the loud room, but the loudest in the quiet room. So I feel like I'm more myself again. Ooh. I just saw some notes yeah. on by Mia's bed side. And it's got like all our names on it. What? Mia was making notes about everyone and it's like not good because there was some negative stuff about us. I think what she writes down is just like what people say every day, what the judges say, blah, blah, blah. Oh my god, that is creepy, yo. I'm sharing my bed with her and she has some notes about maybe me. This is psycho. I thought this is a model show, not a psychopath show. Do you guys think she's talking about us? With the other group? Because she's always there. But I just find it a little strange that she, you know, Exactly! She's two faces! I really don't like two-faced person. I don't like when you said something bad about one person in the bag. That is not cool, man. That is not cool. So are you gonna confront her? I will confront her. I am super pissed right now, man. Like, I cannot accept this. Welcome to your photo shoot. Since this week is all about transformation, we are going to transform all of you into gorgeous swans in a spellbound fantasy fashion editorial photo shoot inspired by the world famous ballet, Swan Lake. And ladies, today is all about creating fantasy with elegance and channeling the gracefulness of a swan. Each of you today will be styled either as black swans or white swans and will be shooting together in opposite pairings. Immediately, I start 
thinking about who I'm going to be paired up with because that person could make or break the photo. Are you guys ready to find out about your pairings? Yes! yes. First pairing is Tan and Dana. I think working with another model will be easier than working with a snake. So, it should be good. <laughs> Eco and Adela. Jesslyn and Mia. <gasps> And next is Beauty with Jack. If I get the best photo this week, he's still gonna be in that wall. I'm gonna crop them. <laughs> I just put myself in the frame. And the last group is Pim and V. And because there's only 11 of you, Beauty, because you got best photo last week, you get to double your chances and pair up with Rubini. Oh shit, if Beauty gets two tries, then she's probably gonna get two best photos of the week. Oh, and by the way, models, your photographer today is me. That's right. I hope that doesn't ruffle your feathers. Ready or not, let's get this flock out of here into hair and makeup. <laughs> I was kind of at the bottom of the pack, so I went to the photo shoot. I want to show the judges that I'm a strong contender. What's so stupid, right? That's how this thing starts. And then at night, I was like, we had this discussion. Oh, you're so two faced, bitch. It was kind of hostile. So Mia was telling me the previous night she had some beef with Jaslyn. And Jasmine was still unfriendly to her. Do you think I'm a two-faced fake bitch? I guess because they don't really mean it in like the insulting way. Last night, Jasmine was being mean. She kept saying, are you being very fake? I did not see that coming. And it hurts. I don't know, I don't know what's the right thing to do at this point. I can't talk to them. I saw Mia crying and talking about me. Even though we have a fight last night, I told her, Mia, you're such a two-faced person, not bitch. But I really apologize, and now she never mentioned I apologize. She just mentioned all the bad things about me. Who felt upset about last night? For sure. For sure. Oh, yeah, for sure. Whew, I need to suck it up first. Deliver this photo, and we talk. Today, you're shooting with another girl. You're going to be the next one. So, you need to show your fear sides. Like, powerful, like everyone look at you and it needs to be scared. Today, the girls are working in here, so I need to remind them they need to stand out. I don't know if I can really deliver that in the photo. You need to be confident, not more confident. I have a lack of confidence and I need to find that fire within me to actually start competing with the other girls. with the white swan. Fantastic. What story are you going to tell today? I'm going to be the fierce and mysterious one and she's okay. going to be the soft but still regal more. All right, let's go. Beautiful. Again, go. The photo shoot is supposed to be graceful and elegant and also I'm pretty slow, so it might come off as elegant. <laughs> a little flat, guys. It's boring. Dana, literally give me a belly. Okay. Go. Go. Beautiful, go, love. I've done a little bit of ballet. I'm gonna throw myself into this one. And not look so small next to it. Super tall, Han. Dana, amazing. Han, she's overpowering you. She's bigger than you and she's shorter than you. Compared to Dana's dress, mine is really long and heavy. It's a bit hard trying to swing it. Han, we're halfway through already and I don't have a single frame. You size wants me to jump more and more. One, two, three, up! Not high enough. I have to just push my limits. High! Higher! I'm gonna give you one more because I'm inspired. I'm gonna jump with you. One, two, three, go! And I feel like I'm just about to do a split in the air if I go any further. Up! Beautiful. You got it. That was great. Thank you. Remember from last week, they don't know what your passion is, why you're here. Show your fire for why you want to be here, Eko. For Eko, I know she has the fire to do this. She needs to learn how to bring out emotions through her eyes to really stand out. Come from the heart so that your eyes will tell the story. Last photo shoot, I can get the feeling. That's why for today's photo shoot, I must get the feeling first and then show it to the other people. 
All right, Iko Adela, what story you want to portray today? Iko has insecurities, and I am her insecurity that she's looking at. Wow. Let's see it. Go. I love what you're doing already. I really want to show more of myself so that I'll be more memorable to the judges. Adela, you're giving me this Edward Scissorhands situation. I love it. I love it. One, two, three, jump! I don't think the other girls view me as tough competition, so I want them to know exactly who they're dealing with. I love the angry of you. You're killing it. One, two, three, go. Iko, are you scared of her? Are you... Yeah, scared. Then the face needs to be fear, right? Remember, this is theatrical. This is story. I don't see it yet. I feel confused. I'm overthinking about myself. What do you need? I want to be mad, but I don't know. You need to help her. I don't know how to be like, afraid or mad. If I'm saying, like, you're not going to be top model, what are you going to say back? I'm going to be top model. OK. Can we try looking at each other? Yeah, let's do it. One, two, three, go. That's quite beautiful. Whatever you said to her is working. Go. Try to get the feeling. I want to be mad. And go. I want to push Adela away because Adela is my insecurity. Go. And that's it, ladies. Thank you so much. Fly away. Beauty and Jack. Here we go. I feel pressure paired up with beauty because she won best photo last week. All I need is to do my best. One, two, three, go. Much better. Go. Jack, beautiful. So, Beauty, in order for you to pop, you, you have to do a lot of work. You gotta throw it. Come on. Yes. I don't move a lot when I do photo shoot because I don't have experience. Have you had dance before? No. Have you do yoga? No. Do you exercise? No. What well, starts today then? One, two, three, go. Yes. That is gorgeous. Jack, amazing. Let's tie your shoes again. Look at me from there, Jack. Make it part of the picture. Yes. Yes, she the camera. Beauty, fly over her. Go. Jack, that is gorgeous. Yay! I'm doing great. Beautiful. Beauty, if the swan's not working for you, you're a giant crow. If she's a roadkill, you want to eat it. OK. You got to do something, because I need stories. Go. But when you look to your right, mm, uh, can you please crop the photo like in between? Just me. <laughs> I hear a yes in the background. Your mentor is happy. Let me hear a yes. Yes. Is Beauty's mentor happy? Not really. Is Beauty's mentor happy? Not really. To telling me that I'm not so good. It's sad. Thank you, Jack. Thank you. Thank you, Ty. Beauty, gotta work harder. I think this week the pressure got to Beauty. Try so hard. You need to show them like you can, you deserve to win. But as a top model, she needs to learn how to deal with the stress. I try so no. hard. <laughs> Come on. Come on. I'm hearing there's a little bit of tension going around the house. I want you to put that all behind. Whatever drama is happening right now, I want you to use that to your advantage and bring this black swan into life. Okay, it's gonna be your biggest weapon now. Okay? Jocelyn and Mia, what stories are you gonna tell? She's the, the angelic one. The angelic one? Yes. And then you're gonna be the evil one. Yes. Your time starts now. One, two, three. Oh, what well, jumpers! I love jumpers! And I'm pretty angry at the whole drama of last night. So I might be able to use this to bring the black swan to life. Go. Make it that you're angry. Beautiful. I really try not to think any of the drama. I don't want to be in the bottom two weeks in a row. Ooh. Under pressure! <laughs> now I need the clashing energy between you two. I really like, what? This photo shoot is reflecting our reality, you know? Like, we need to clash at each other. Ready for the pain? Don't hurt each other. Fashion bump. Oh my god. Drama's coming, drama's coming. Jump. Beautiful. I don't care about the consequences of this one. I'm just like throwing myself in, literally. Go. Make that real. Oh my god. Yeah, girl. It kind of feels good. Stay there, stay there. Make it part of the picture. Go. Now you're inspiring me. Yes, make it pretty. Last frame, ladies. 
Make this work. Thank you, ladies. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much, Shirsai. Ping and V. What story are you going to tell today? It's about a love story. I feel jealous with her beauty, and I just want to take her to me. I'm just trying to escape and looking at freedom. I love this story. Let's see your jealousy. One, two, three, go. Yes. Our height is a big factor, so we came up with this tactic of her pulling me down while I'm jumping in the air, like trying to escape from her. V, I don't believe you're jealous of her. Who are you jealous most in this world? Uh. Oh my. I feel very scared. I feel frozen. What need to say? What need to answer? Because I'm not jealous of anyone. You're not a jealous person. Just say you wish you were tall, because you're always complaining you're short. So, what emotion do you want to convince me? Anger. All right, go. So I need to change the topic. That I'm angry. Like I really need to kill someone. Be much better. Go. There we go. One, two, three, go. Him, don't give me melodramatic. Don't give me the. Oh, 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 I'm scared. Don't give me that. Give me fashion. Oh, okay. I was in theater the whole time, and now he wants me to be actually like fashion. Ready? I have high hopes for you guys. Go. Last frame. Your best frame. Rubini and Beauty. So Beauty, you're back. Just second time around. Yes. What story are we telling today? So we want to tell a story of how a strong woman is, a reflection of each other. All right, I want to see two powerful women in front of me. Go. I am so grateful for another chance with Rubini. So I want to do better with her. One, two, three, go. Beauty decided to jump now. I guess she's feeling better. I need to have confidence. Are you more comfortable now, Beauty? Yes, I am. I just don't want to go home. Here we go. One, two, three, go. Two powerful women. Right now, you guys are separated. You don't even know each other. So you gotta find a common energy. I am really angry with Beauty. There is not even a moment she looked at me or tried to connect with me. Beauty, because you didn't do well in the last one, and now you're overcompensating. You have to work with your partner. Okay? And uh, that kind of just ruined the whole vibe of the shoot. Here we go. Rubini, I'm losing you. You're not powerful enough today. As long as Rubini is distracted by somebody else, then she's a little bit lost. It's all about the face that tells the story. One, two, three, go. Elimination is coming up. Yes, I'm scared. I don't want to have a bad photo. And that's a wrap, ladies. I guess we pull up the photo shoot a lot, but. I mean, we need to work this out, man. We stay in the same What I'm saying. Don't say, like, I'm the bitch one here. Like, make you cry all I'm night. I'm saying, I'm exactly saying, I'm sorry happened. last okay. night. It's, it's not, not enough, enough from me. No. When I first you came in, different you say, you're man. always interrupting me. I can never speak. So people look at me as a bitch, but then she has two faces. And nobody's knowing. What you're saying is that I'm not no, no longer allowed to think about this, and no longer allowed to cry my tears and be upset no, about it. No, I didn't say that. Did I say that? I apologize. Remember? Pop out in your head. Great. The whole gang ready. No. Ready to take me down. Oh my God. See, you have a negative feeling. If you are not comfortable to me, just say it to my face. You say I'm making you look bad. I'm not trying to say look. it to my face. That's all I need. Just be real. You yell at me. You don't listen to me. I cannot win this fight. Oh, I felt like shit. Do you hate me when you see that? I think maybe tensions are really high right now. That's why you're clashing. And I think the best thing is to remove yourself from the situation so you can focus on why you're here and why you came here. Let's go to our room. Bye. I think that the best solution is to just separate Mia and Jocelyn. So you don't need to say anything. We're inviting you because we trust you. <laughs> Trust works both ways. It's not a highway and a bicycle path. <laughs> uh, girl drama. So do you want us to go in first? No, I'm going first. Hi, guys. Hi. Oh. Wait, oh, is everyone here? Everyone? No, no, no. They're just helping me carry my bags. I feel like you'll be more comfortable with me out there. No, it's, oh, it's your more comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. You are yeah. not us. Stop. No, you move to another room so you can be comfortable. 
I'm not the bitch here. If you guys not comfortable in this room, if I want you to go, trust me, I'll say it right away. You know, why should I put myself in a position where I am emotionally distressed? I think it's the right thing to remove myself from the toxic situation. I'm pissed you got the whole bed to yourself. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anyone want to join my bed? <laughs> you are welcome. If she cannot handle us, then she needs to leave. I'm not going to trust Mia anymore. That's all. I'm very grateful that you're giving me a place to sleep. It's okay. <laughs> It's not nice if we really had like this huge divide between two rooms. I think it's so bad right now. Like it's it's mm. like if I have to choose between wasting my energy, building friendships, or focusing on the competition, I will always choose the competition for sure. I think moving into our room is the best if it gives you a chance for both of you to like cool down and get some distance. Coming into this elimination, I think if Jessalyn left the competition, then there would be a lot less hostility. Welcome, ladies, to your next elimination. I'm so happy to see how gorgeous and refreshed you look after your new makeovers. But before we find out who's staying and who's going this week, let me first introduce you to your judges. First up, we have celebrity TV personality from Malaysia, the very lovely Marianne Potter. Hey, girl. Hi. And of course, our extremely talented creative director, who was also your photographer this week, Yusai. Models, models, models. Yusai, Yusai, Yusai. All right, ladies, shall we get to your prizes? The winner of Asia's Next Top Model will drive home the all-new Subaru XV. She will have a fashion spread and grace the cover of Harper's Bazaar Thailand. She will also become a featured avatar in the America's Next Top Model new mobile game. And she will be represented by top model agency Storm Model Management, which has launched the careers of successful models and talent, including the likes of Lottie Moss and Fran Summers. All right, we will start with our first pair, Dana and Han. Hi, guys. Hi. So this week, you had to transform into black and white swans. Well, why don't we take a look at your shot then and go from there? Marion, do you like Dana's photo? I love the body. Everything about it is beautiful except the face. I just needed more out of the face. Dana, you look like a seasoned ballerina. It's amazing to watch. You are like a prima donna in a theater, or should I say, prima Dana. So let's move on to Han. Did you feel good on set? I am not comfortable with the dress. It's really long and it keeps getting tangled. Uh, once you started moving the dress, it did not work. It wasn't so much your dress was tangled, it was your mind. My first glance at the picture, Han, you popped for me. You really have to believe in yourself and it'll show. Han, I see gorgeous, majestic black swan there. And the girls standing in front of me are completely two different animals. But I'm worried that it's a lucky shot. Thank you, girls. Thank you. Eco and Adela, please step forward. Hi, ladies. Hi. What's going on here, Iko? You know what's going on, Cindy? <laughs> what's going on? It's a musical theater. You don't feel it? Oh, wait, wait, wait. See? I love this picture. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's giving no. me dance no. forever. I laugh when I look at this picture. What's not working in this picture is the face. You have one emotion throughout the entire time. So if that's the pose you wanted, like Pinocchio in the marionette scene, like, that would work. I kind of want to love it, but yeah, no. Adela. She was so fierce. It was like Edward Scissorhand on crack coming <laughs> after me to give me a haircut. It was so cool. Even when Eco almost fell or Eco was confused, she still back there like, I'm going to keep going, I'm going to keep going. <laughs> I love, 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 love this. Looking at you here, you're like sweet little innocent thing. <laughs> In that picture, you're like a man wow, eating wow. a dresser, you know? I'm just in love with that shot of you. Thank you. Well, honey, you are definitely standing out. I see you very clearly right now. I want you to be able to transform like that every single week. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Mia and Jocelyn, please. Hi, girls. Hello. 
We'll talk about Mia's performance first. I like your eyes. It's almost like it's telling me a story. It's wanting to tell me a story. And that's what drew me to this picture of you. Thank you. Hmm. Interesting. You don't agree? No. I feel like you haven't really committed to becoming demonic. It's like you're on your way there, but you're not there yet. I'm just kind of stuck in the middle with you. Kind of like them, purgatory. This is a purgatory shot. Two birds in the purgatory. Shall we move on to Jesslyn then, Yusai? There's something about you that is not clicking exactly where it needs to be. You're doing too much. This is what you do when you're on set. <sighs> it was so dramatic. I didn't know what to do with those pictures. Jesslyn, your face has left the building. Their legs are just kind of hanging there, your wingings broken. It looks like a story of survival more than transformation. And I'm sorry, ladies, not my favorite photo this week. Thank you. Thank you. Next, V and Pim. Hello, ladies. Hi. Let's focus on V first. I think this is the first picture that screams teamwork. You guys got it. I almost think you look like twins. Look at the two of you, I'm like, aww. For me, if anything, is a little bit too much raw emotion there. I still want you to look beautiful. Otherwise, well done, honey. And Pim, I would never have thought you would be so elegant. Was she listening to you this time, you said? She doesn't always deliver what you ask her to do. I had to sit back and let her do her thing. It did work this time. Hmm. Be careful about that, though, because sometimes you still need to deliver the, what the clients want and what the photographer's vision is. In this case, it worked. I wish there was a little bit more of a vulnerability, a gentleness in your face, than would have been perfect. Well done, ladies. Thank you. Thank you, you too. Thank you, you too. Aw, oh, so cute, so much, cute, so much love, love, there's all love up in there. Thank you. Next up, Beauty and Jack. Hello, ladies. Hello. Beauty, beauty, beauty. This picture is not successful. You were jumping, you were hopping, but the purpose for it, it wasn't there. I get no emotion from you. And you jump up like a bat rather than like a bird. Beauty, beauty, beauty. I get no emotion from you. And you jump up like a bat rather than like a bird. Really disappointed, Beauty. You had best performance last week. You should have taken this opportunity to go with what was happening in that moment where your modeling instincts have to take over. And maybe because you're so new at modeling, you still don't have the instinct, or maybe you have it, but you don't know how to trust it yet. All in all, not a very strong image for you. Jack, this was what I call mistakes give you magical creations. It was a beautiful mistake that you embodied the moment and carried it on and gave such authenticity in it. You may have just saved this picture. I want to almost zoom in and crop beauty out. It's funny, you're on the ground, but my eyes are looking straight at you, and it's just stunning in every way. There you are, crumpled on the floor, yet you managed to overshadow your co-star, who is literally spread eagle in midair. And it's gorgeous. I'm literally so obsessed with this photo of you, Jack. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much. Beauty, what's your struggle? I was overthinking too much, and I thought I didn't do very good. That's why. Fake it till you make it. That's no difference in building a fantasy and creating a magical moment for us. Thank you, Jack. Beauty, please stay here because we have one more photo which you are in. Thank you. Thank you, Jack. Can we have Rubini, please? So, Rubini, you came up with a story of reflection of each other's strengths. Yeah. Let's take a look at the photo. I actually love the story they had. They want to be woman power. Rubini, I didn't see power from you. And I felt like you gave up on beauty, and therefore you gave up. It's funny how you said you were be a reflection of her. It almost feels like you took her negative energy and then portrayed it. I don't see strength here. In fact, I see someone who's lost among her feathers, which is a big disappointment because you were so strong for me last week. I mean, yours was one of the top photos. And beauty, you look powerful in this photo. Thank you. Whatever happened after the first photo shoot, you recovered beautifully. 
My only thing is, it looks a lot like your image last week. In fact, almost identical. So be careful not to be a one-trick pony. Otherwise, it's a good shot. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. All right, ladies, it is now time to tabulate your photo shoot scores. And when you return, I will be announcing who's still in the running towards becoming Asia's next top model. The first name I call is the girl who has had the best performance of the week. Second, your mistake created a magical moment and earned you best photo of the week. Congratulations, Jackin. You are still in the running towards becoming Asia's next top model. Thank you so much. Adela. I am noticing you for all the right reasons, Adela. Thank you. Kim. Way to bounce back from the bottom, Kim. Thank you. Thank you. Dana. Congratulations. V. Congratulations. Thank you. Mia. Han. Beauty. Rubini. You're through. Thank you. Eco and Jesslyn, please step forward. Jesslyn, here you are again, two weeks in a row. This cannot be about survival. It has to be about coming out on top. Eco, your performance this week just got lost in translation. So who stays and who goes? Let's find out. Jesslyn, you survived. Barely. You're still in the running for it's becoming Asia's next top model. Thank you. Okay. It's not the end. Thank you. I disappointed that I cannot go far in this competition. Maybe I'm not open enough to show my personality to people. I want to change my attitude from shy to be brave. And they know the real echo. Promise. Next time on Asia's Next Top Model. The next thing she was talking shit. Tensions deepen between Mia and the loud girls. I wish, I really wish you a little bit human. Whatever I do, whatever I say is taken out of context whenever they please. And as the girls face yet another unexpected Hi, surprise. Come on out, mentors! <laughs> oh my god. Fatigue begins to take a toll on some. <laughs> then don't forget to subscribe because then you won't miss out on any of the excitement and did you see this video yet this one see all these videos you wouldn't be missing them if you subscribe right here subscribe right now for asia's next top model